Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Purple Hyacinth episode 91 to 92. Holy cow. Uh, due to Webtoon's new policy, I do the blur 50% of each episode. So if you guys do want to read along with me, it's available on webtoons.com. For anyone out there who wants to support me, I do have all my reads on patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. And here you guys have no censorship there's no cat logo blur so if that's something you guys are interested in please check it out on there so let's go ahead and get started all right so it said uh turn on music so here we go in charge of assassination uh and espionage hold on i'm gonna see if i can pronounce this espionage espionage okay <laughs> and that word means the practice of spying or of using spies typically by government to obtain political and military information that's a very fancy word this is the fourth reporting in here are the spies res reports on the seventh weapons operation Another undeclared nitroglycerin import arrived successfully, successfully yesterday. Lloyd and Flemings ensured its transfer to their usual hideout. They are only waiting on one more this 14th. They'll likely launch their little insurrection soon after. <laughs> Did the seventh really think we wouldn't notice? The traitors are falling like flies even within their own ranks. And what of the purple Pisces? He's been lazing around the police station for weeks. Still hasn't sent any news concerning Loon, only his usual reports of the precinct. Then perhaps we should remind him. What happens to those who ignored my orders? My messenger is already on it. Purple Hyacinth, episode 91. Content warning. This episode contains allusions to abuse which may be triggering to some readers. Viewer discretion is advised. Mmm, oh snap. All right. In charge of finances, weapon operation. Apostle, is that like, what number is that? 15? I'm not good at reading this. Or seven. I keep forgetting that's like a V and one one. It's like, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Apostle seven. St Finally. I was starting to think you forgot about our rendev rendezvous. I can't ever say that word. I cannot. Rendezvous. How on earth is that word pronounced rendezvous? All right. Well, I'm sorry, guys. I'm getting better at pr my pronunciation, okay? I'm, I'm practicing. I'm getting better at it. I promise. Cut. Bella. You make me come all the way here instead of just sending your messenger. And you expect me to be on time. That's awfully rude. Aren't you happy to see me? I'm seeing you too often since I started doing shows again. Why are you even wearing that mask, Seven? Well, it's a serious official business after all. Apostles are required to wear one when they speak to their subordinates. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> You're spoiling my fun. Here are my reports from my most recent contracts. Give them to the fourth. I'm not going through the hassle of reaching out to his damned messenger. I must say, congratulations. You've become quite infamous. 
gruesome and ambitious, just as always. I'm sure the fourth will be pleased with your work. Of course. Do I ever disappoint? By the way, we received a delivery yesterday. Our last two players are still sticking to the plan like obedient pawns. I think neither Flemings nor Alvera will surprise us. Splendid. Only a few more weeks before we can reclaim what's ours. Isn't that exciting? Putting this city through fire and blood? Extremely. I am bored out of my mind these days. Poor little thing. All those insipid, meaningless murders. You haven't had much fun since Sake. Almost a shame you killed him so quick. Unless he was and getting on my nerves. He only got what he was begging for. And what about the curious police officer? I had a few questions for him about the officer who almost exposed him. She's useful to my infiltration mission. I wanted to make sure Saki wouldn't stab her to death in the back alley. Before I'm ready to get rid of her. Nothing new. Hasn't made his peep since. My, my. You are awfully serious today, Bella. Who is it? Something on your mind? Bella? A life I never chose. You of all people should know how that feels. Absolutely nothing. Great. It would have been such a shame if that girl upset you again. Our good old messenger let me know she visited you yesterday. You aren't still mad at me over her, I hope. You know it was for your own good. Emotions will only get you killed, Bella. I've taught you better than that. They would only make you lose your spark. And you know I have no use for dead matches. Uh, but a single spark can burn you down. So be careful how you play with it. <laughs> there you are, Bella. I knew you weren't hiding too deep. Do you need me for something else? I received a new mission for you this morning, Bella. The leader wants you to keep an eye on the Purple Heisen. Keep him alive, though. Or as alive as he'll be after the fourth through with him. Our spy master is not as forgiving as I am. <sighs> the Purple Heisen. You know, you aren't stealthy, right? I could see you from the entrance. We didn't need to be. You know why you didn't run. <sighs> uh, they're gonna jump him. Oh, he was able to dodge that? <laughs> Oops. Oh my goodness. <coughs> Did the leader finally decide to get rid of me? No. This is just a reminder to complete your mission. Oh, how kind of him. What did he tell you to do? Just spare only your face. Wah. Oh my gosh. Purple Hyson, episode 92. Uh, uh. Oh my gosh.
here and he's so bruised up. <laughs> you didn't have to leave me alive. One last thing, I want to thank everyone who signed up for the security team as Viscount Redcliffe's ball on the 17th. I have forwarded the list to the Lord Brimzo. Lieutenant Hawks and Sergeant Liddell will, be hold, will hold a session for all of you volunteers soon to discuss preparations and coordinations with other precincts. This is all for today. Dismissed. Dagen was right to order police presence. With Phantom Scythe members among the guests and circus crew, is the entire circus pantheon involved? And we still have to figure out what Flemings will be doing there with their with the others. I didn't join the security team because infiltrating the event the old-fashioned way will reap better results, but they will be there too. We haven't talked since that night. They're dead. Ugh. Do you really think the purple hyacinth is leaving flowers next to his victim as a threat to the royals? No. Wait, Mr. White? Sorry for bothering you. I need to take a look at some paperwork I left on your tro trolley earlier. I forgot to sign, uh, forgot to sign something. Gloves. Oh, no problem, Officer Sinclair. It should be here. We have to talk. Can we meet at your apartment tonight? Wah, looks who's in a rush. Do you miss me already? Ugh. Tch. I think it's preferable that no one sees you anywhere near my apartment for now. Oi, Sinclair. Lieutenant Hawks is briefing us on the... In Itinerary change. What are you doing? Let's meet at the cave after work, then. Come here, Randall. Thanks for the fall, Mr. White. Have a good day. Liddell, why are we here? Shouldn't we be investigating employees at the Carmine Camilla? Oh, uh, that weird lady swore she saw Loon here, but no one was able to confirm. We don't have time for this. We should be looking into security protocols for the ball. I know what we have to do. Meet me at Ro Rosalind's cafe in an hour. Alonzi! Gods. An hour later. Liddell, are you smo- No, this is a special Agent White Swan. Yes, I'm not- I'm smoking hot. <laughs> special Agent White Swan. And you- Your codename is Black Raven. Special Agent Black Raven. <sighs> okay, what is this? First, McTrevor. Onslow, Blakesley, and Coden killed by the Purple Heisen. Four people with four different backgrounds. Then their sock is murdered by the same assassin as Harvey. Soon after that night, the weird lady supposedly saw Loon at the Carmine. December 26th. Hmm. Only Ryan Flemings had a reservation for 11 p.m. And that's when the weird lady was there. Yes, it was a room for four. Peculiar guess. We were told not to enter. And the weird lady was actually right and the staff were forbidden to enter the only other room occupied at the time. We should look into the Rhine Flemings because it sounds suspicious. <laughs> I can't smoke. This was a terrible decision. I've seen his name before. He's a banker, if I recall correctly. But we don't have the slightest idea who the others were. And nothing guarantees that the woman didn't confuse the security guys for Loom. Something must have been going on. Would you like to order anything, ma'am? Oh, Lauren, God, it's a deduction! 
lend the powers to humble to my humble mortal self. Oh, what is she? <laughs> it's not working. Lawrence has abandoned me. You know, you can just give her a phone call at this point. Yes, miss. I would like to order a hammer to knock me out this cruel world. Oh my gosh, she is so dramatic. <laughs> Don't mind her, miss. Two cups of tea, please. Hello, police. I'd like to report. We are the cops. Hey, could you keep it down? Oh my, is that you, Mr. Evans? So oh, you came here with your wife this time. You have a wife? <gasps> oh, this isn't his wife? Anyways, Black Raven, you know what's curious? Saki was killed at the circus, right? Behind the artist tent of all places. Didn't seem like the type to go to the circus shows for fun. I'm not sure how that connects with everything else, but there's something weird. What? That Lauren was at the circus too? Yes, that, and the Circus Royale's big, next big gig is a reception for Radcliffe's ball. <sighs> hmm, okay, and, oh man, this is so funny. And don't you think it's weird that Lauren didn't sign up for that? That surprised me too, but knowing Herman was reviewing the candidate Candidatures, candidatures. Maybe she thought she would get rejected anyways. It's not really like her. She's been trying so hard to redeem herself since Sake. I'm worried for her, you know? Tem Sake, he's back in town. I know it was wrong of me to follow him, but could I really just ignore him after all he's done? Could you please keep this between us? Cross my heart and hope to die. You're giving me anxiety, but I'll comply. After Sake's murder and the new leads from Chao's case, I wouldn't be surprised if you tried to investigate that circus further. But wouldn't the security team be the perfect cover if that's what you wanted? Well, exactly, which is why... Which is why what? You know what I mean. I think Lauren is loon. Oh, they finally said it. Oh my gosh. Ugh. They thought, they, I mean, we kind of knew that Kim kind of like caught on to something. Like, you know, that Lauren is Loon, but she never said it out loud. Like, we can tell she kind of like piecing it together. But I now they're on a hunch and now they just need to prove that part, you know? But man, the read is getting so good. And I'm looking at my reflection, I'm just like, oh my gosh, I need to lose weight. Because, oh my, face is so round. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed my web webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!